Hi, so we're gonna do some microscopy today. Um, I just did a fungal microscopy class online, um, but that's kind of just me talking at you and it's definitely easier if you can see the process of what we're actually doing. So I'm gonna show you what I'm doing. Um, here I have a spore print. This is from an agaricus that I did on a slide. And I'm gonna put some of those spores under the microscope. Okay. So first I've got water and I put a drop of water on the side. Okay, then I'm going to use my little doohickey and scrape some spores. And I can see that I've got some on the drop. Okay. And then I'm going to get out a cover slip, trying not to touch it too much with my hand. Just one. They look a little dirty, so I'm going to clean it with my shirt a little. It's probably fine. And then I place it on here. Okay, and if there was more material on this, um, like a bit of mushroom flesh, I might squash it a little bit by using the end of the pencil, not my finger, so I don't get my finger grease on it. Okay. And then I'm going to turn on my microscope. And there's this little arm here. And I'm going to put it inside here. It gets held with the edge and the arm goes into place. And then I use this thingy right here to, to adjust where the slide is. And I make sure that it goes so that it's lined up with the objective here. And then I'm going to look through and see if I can see anything. And I'm using the course adjustment knob here first. There we go, until something comes into focus. And then maybe adjust a little bit more as needed. Okay, so I know that I at least have my specimen in focus now. Something is on there. And then I'm going to go to a higher magnification. So it's zooming in more. And then I'm using my fine focus again to zoom in more. Okay, so now I have my spores on the screen. I've got tons and tons of spores. This is great. Okay. Um, but I am on the um, 10x objective and I have 10x uh, eyepieces on here. So I'm at um, so I'm at 100 times magnification right now. And then I'm going to switch to the 40 times magnification. And that's times 10 of 10 and my IP. So these are 10 X objectives. So now I'm looking at 400 times magnification. All right. And I'm zooming in again with my fine adjustment. That's what I'm doing with my hand here. Okay. And now I've got spores. Okay. So now I would start measuring spores. And I'm going to have you look through the screen at what I'm looking at here on, and you can see their size through this. Okay. So as you can see, they're quite small. Um, and because we're looking at them under 400x, um, the, that's not a one-to-one -one ratio with the little ruler. So I have a cheat sheet here I'm going to show you. So when I am looking at the microscope under 40x, um, that is going to be um, one RU. That's a reticle unit. That's the little ruler I'm looking at through the eye. That's 2.5 microns or micrometers. That's a measurement. So for every one unit that I'm looking at through the eye eyepiece, it's going to be 2.5 microns. So if I find something and the spore is 
the spore is three reticle units long, then it's actually 7.5 units in real life. Um, so that is how you would measure the spores. Hopefully that's helpful to people.